Overland is one of 1,741 games in the bundle for racial justice and equality. I am Loki Knight and I am delving into said bundle with Overland, where you take care of a group of travellers on a post-apocalyptic road trip across the United States in this turn-based survival game by Finji. Fight scary creatures, rescue stranded survivors and scavenge for supplies like fuel, first aid kits and weapons. Decide where to go next, whether it's upgrading this wrecked car or rescuing that dog. Just remember, there are consequences for every action. Get ready for close calls, dramatic escapes, hard choices, arguing about whether or not that dog gets rescued, and the end of the world. That's what it does indeed say on the itch.io page, at least. And I will not lie, I have played a chunk of this game already, because I'd heard of Overland, and I'd heard of how insanely difficult it was, and I'd also heard that you can give a doggo some pats. I had to give the doggo some pats. I had to! I had to! And then, and then the city limits. But I will say, I was very sad that uh, the doggo that I gave Pats, unfortunately, they did pass away. They were called Sushi, and they were a good girl. But, but I digress. I digress indeed. Overland is basically XCOM meets FTL, uh, where the apocalypse die got rolled on aliens. That's the monster of the week, at least in this apocalypse. And you can see, you got like a little car. We go brum brum across the United States, and each little sort of like section that you see which you can see here in the background is sort of like your little tile set that you have to move around. We'll, we'll get into the game and I'll explain it as I go. Another thing that I think is absolutely beautiful about this game is you can be an absolute masochist with it. So there are level restarts. You can turn that on or off. I'm going to leave it off because I do like things being a little bit more permadeath. Uh, however, there's also a countdown so you can place a time limit on each turn. I am not that much of a masochist. I will not be doing the countdown, but for the sake of permadeath, I will be leaving level restart off. And so, we shall start a new game. And so, we get into the East Coast, the very first little sort of like level flavour set that you have. It's like the first sector in FTL. And one thing I do want to say straight away is I love the art style of this game. It's got like that voxely, pixely art style where it's just all like flat shapes and flat colours. I love what Finji did with that. Um, oh! Enid! <gasps> We've got a doggo to rescue! So, yes, uh, I mentioned uh, Enid, that's awesome, because essentially, well, Enid Blyton actually loved their books. But secondly, all of the names and, and all the background and, and all that jazz, the people that you come across, is all procedurally generated. So, my name and my survivor for this one is Enid! Was third cello in the city orchestra, tires easily. That's not good. Don't want to get tired too easily, but we need to rescue Doggo. I don't know who the Doggo is, but but, but I want to rescue Doggo. Want to rescue Doggo? Woof woof, yes! What's in there? Oh, I'm going to pick that up. And we're going to go rescue the doggo, because the doggo does need to be rescued. And the turn. Doggo! Um, okay, we've got to drag that out of the way. Come on! Okay, and again. Get it out of the way. We've got to go rescue that doggo. It, it is of paramount importance. Hello there! <gasps> no! Uh, make friends. Invite. What's your name? Woof. Yes. Are you a friendly doggo or an aggressive doggo? Brick likes to shake hands, maybe four years old. Ah, Okay, Brick, what can you tell me about yourself? Because you can actually inspect them. So, Brick. Friendly, likes pats. Yay. Defensive, can push creatures away. Ah, so rather than biting, because there's th there are different kinds of doggos, rather than biting, this one can push creatures away. So it doesn't actively damage the aliens. It just pushes them away. They're a pacifist doggo. Nice. Brick, you're a good boy. Uh, I'm going to need you to get in the car, okay? And uh, all will be okay. Get in the car, be a good boy. Unfortunately, dogs don't have opposable thumbs, so their downside is they can't drive cars. Their upside is they're hecking adorable. Hecking adorable indeed. So end the turn. We've now got an alien there. Uh, I'm not interested in that alien, and instead we are going to get the heck out of it. Wait, can Brick pull in Enid? Brick can pull in Enid. That is awesome. Okay, Brick, you are a good boy. Uh, Enid, we are going to uh, turn on the car. Because you're the only one that can, because you're a human. And we're going to escape. Bye, alien! Whee! And that is what you have to do. You've essentially got to save people, gather resources, all that good stuff, while avoiding being hit. Because that is not all. Uh, the health and the action points, the, the little health bars that you saw right next to uh, when they were moving and stuff, they're intertwined. So if they take a hit, not only are they down at health, but they're also down an action point. So this game is brutal. 
amazingly brutal, and I love it. We are going to go get some fuel, because I like uh, stocking up on fuel. Come on, Brick. You're a good boy. Yes, you are. Are they a black, lab a black Labrador? I don't know. Are they a Brick Labrador? Yes. Hello. Sunset. Ooh. I hear a wee-woo, wee-woo, and there's some fuel over there, and there's aliens over here. Okay. Brick. Uh, let's see you push an alien. So you can... No, I know. You can push. Shove him. Heck off. There we go. So that pushed the alien back. So Brick is pacifist, doggo. And I like that very much. Uh, you can pick up a bottle, because that's a ranged weapon, I believe. That's where you've got to go get this fuel. Go, go get that fuel behind uh, the car over on the right. So pick up the bottle. And uh, end the turn if you can. Oh, I might be able to move around, because that alien cannot move diagonally. So that is very useful. There we go. So alien cannot move diagonally, but now I can get back around here, so I can move over here. I can pick that up. There we go. So now I've got one fuel. That isn't much. Not gonna lie, I do need more fuel than that. That's not good. Not good in the slightest. Brick is fine where they are, and actually... Brick might want to go here, because then they can push the alien back away from them again. Which will leave up space for Enid to get back in the car. There we go. So they move around. Brick is going to be a good boy and push back that dude up. Heck off. Yeah. Brick, you're a good boy. Oh. Ah. Search this. More fuel. There we go. Uh, This one is two fuels. We'll pick that up. Perfect. And we're going to wiggle around the back. There we are. And then they're going to move towards us again. But Brick is going to be a good boy and keep on defending their human. Heck off. Headbutt. <laughs> Give him a Glasgow kiss. Great. Ina, get over here. Fill up the car. And Brick, be a good boy and get over here. There we go. End the turn. There, there is an undo button. I will not be using it. Oh, I could search that too. Look, Brick, just push them away. Shove. Heck off. Okay, we need to get that in the car. Fill that up. Fill her up. There we go. How much fuel is in the car? Eight. Okay, I think it's time for everybody to get in the car. I think we're done searching right about now. Uh, nobody can get in the car, so we just end the turn. And now uh, everybody gets in the car. So, Brick, I want you to get in the car. Thank you very much. Good boy. Enid, I want you to get in the car. Turn it on, and then wiggle the heck out of there. So turn on, and leave! So yeah, you can pretty much see how the game is put together now. Um, and it, it's just relatively simple. But it gets more difficult. <laughs> we need people. Hello. Yay, a person! We need a person that can, you know, actually wield a stick. Brick is a good defensive boy, but look, we need to actually kill things. Uh, that, well, we could get a new car, but we've got an empty space in our current one. So let's go and get a friend. Friend. And away we go. Good boy. They're riding shotgun. Yeah. Day one, night. Where's our per- It's another dog boy! <laughs> too many doggo- Well, you can never have too, too many doggos. Brick, go make friends. Invite friend. Aww. Get friend. Yay! Huck. Pretty used to this sort of thing. Maybe five years old. What can he tell- You're injured! No! Huck's injured. You can bark. What does that do? Inspect. Bark. Likes to bark. <laughs> okay, so you, you can attract enemies. I don't know how good that is. Full bottle. Not great for biting, but very smelly. Beautiful thing about this game is that, uh, yeah, doggos, they've got different flavor tags for each item. It's, it's brilliant. Absolutely brilliant. Anyway, Herc, we're going to need you to get in the car. Uh, oh, can you actually move? Ooh. You know it. Can you grab the first aid kit? Yep, yeah, there's a first aid kit in the car. Grab the first aid kit. You're going to go heal up the doggo. You need to go here. There we go. And we're going to heal up the doggo. And the turn. Because I don't want a doggo die. No. You heal the doggo. Here you go. Good boy. Who's a good boy? Now, Herc, go search that thing for me. Search. Go on. You can do it. <gasps> wow. Okay. Uh... <laughs> Herc just pitched up a, a pipe wrench. That's actually a solid weapon. Uh, inspect. What is that? 
bad stick. <laughs> it's a metal stick, yes. Uh, brick, can you... That would be getting in the car. Uh, get round the back for me. Whack, good boy. And then Enid, I'm going to need you to get back in the car. So, end the turn. Okay, Brick, search that for me. What's in there? What the heck is that? It's a plant. What's that going to do? Plant. Would love to eat this. Don't, don't nom it. No. Can you get in the car? You can. Who's a good boy? Get in the car with the plant. Thank you. Herc, you're going to go around here. And you're going to give the human the, b the bad stick. And then Enid, you can give them the good stick. Anyway, I want you to get in the car. Let's go. And Herc cannot get in the car yet, but we're not going to drive off without them. That would be rude. So get in the car, please. Whiff, whiff. Brilliant. We're going to then, uh, yeah, we're going to turn on the car, if I can. Turn it on. And leave, please. Escape. Yeah. So now we've got... <laughs> A vet and their two doggos. That's basically what we're cosplaying as. Cosplaying? Role-playing as, yes. Why not both? Why not both? Better figure out where to go next with our plant and two doggos. I shall call you... Hmm... Percy the Platy Plant. Yes. You are now Percy. I feel like something's watching us. Ooh, spooky. No! Whiff. <laughs> okay, then. So we've got a... Oh, folks looking to trade. That could be useful. Anyway, let's organise first. Brick, put that down don't need that. Uh, and you can give me that. There we go. So now I've got loads of weapons. We've got our Percy in the back seat, two doggos, and Enid. Brilliant. We're going to go see if we can't trade a little bit. Heard there's folk looking to trade out here, or... Hmm. I would like another med kit, but we do need fuel. And I don't think they're just going to want a plant. Let's go get some fuel. Let's go get some fuel. Percy is our friend. We won't trade them. Wouldn't trade Percy for the world. Well, per trade Percy for a med kit, but don't tell them that. Shh, don't tell Percy I said that. That'd be very mean. Okay, a little bit of fuel over there. Doggo the thing is, the good thing about this is the doggos can go and get the fuel while I defend the doggos. So, Brick, go over here. You can't search that yet. Herc, I want you to go over here. There we go. And Enid, I want you to be here. There we go. End of turn. Okay, they're going to be drawn to us. Now, uh, Brick, be a good boy. Search. What are you going to find? Fuel! Good boy! Uh, Herc needs to go and get that. Ooh. Actually, I think Enid should go and get that. Yeah, Enid should go back around and get that fuel, but they can actually pick this fuel up here. Siphon the fuel! Yes. Because there's actually fuel in there. And then... Herc might be able to distract, so if they go... He, do they just bark randomly, or, or can they just... Okay, so if you go here, and then... Here? He, here? Hmm. Where do I want you to go? Because if... Yeah, if, if I go here, can you then... No, barking would require an action. Okay, that's fine. Uh, Brick, I want you to go up here, please. There we go. Very well, and then uh, if I siphon more, that's fine. Siphon that. That's a siphon action. Two fuel should be enough, and then we want to get the heck out of here. Although I do want to pick that back up. No, drop that. Pick that one up. There we go. So now I've got a weapon and some fuel on my back, so we're going to want to move around here. There we go, and then... Ooh, that's one bit. Thing is, I don't want Herc drawing this guy closer to Enid, because that will be a very bad time indeed. Instead, I'm going to get Herc to... Ooh. Apparently that would be bad. Don't go that way. Yeah, we'll get Herc to go over here. There we go. And then Herc can go up here. They'll be safe over there. Enid can go around... Here, they'll be safe over there. And Brick can go here and drop the fuel in favour of a stick. Good boy. Okay, perfect. So again, you're just having to think about what you're doing. Uh, okay, Enid, I need you to get over here. Thank you very much. Uh, Herc. The thing is, 
I want to see what Herc's ability does. So, Bark. That didn't sound good. Maybe you shouldn't do that. Maybe you shouldn't bark. That doesn't seem like a good idea. <laughs> okay, let's not do that again. Um, okay, Enid, fill up the car, please. Fill her up. Brick, I want you to get in the car. Thank you. With your stick, because you're a good boy. You're going to pick up that fuel. Pick it up. And then Herc is going to stand here. Mm, can they get in the car? They can get in the car. Good boy. Perfect. Uh-oh. Fair enough. Okay, let's get you here. Stick that in the car. Bam, that should get us up to seven fuel, eight fuel. Perfect. Get in the car. Oh. Uh-oh. Uh, get in the car, get in the car. <laughs> Turn it on. And escape. Okay, that got a little bit dicey. Let's maybe not let Herc bark. That's not a good idea, and I don't know what that does for me. Apart from just attract more aliens. Uh, somebody's going to have to go in and clear that blockade. Well, neither of our doggos can bark. Well, yeah, actually, Herc can bark, but neither of our doggos can bite. Hmm. Herc's bark is literally worse than their bite. Uh, and then we've got our boy Brick. You can push things. That might be useful. But we are going to need... Enid to actually drive the car. So, yeah, Enid, I think you're going to have to be the one that's going to have to clear that blockade. Sorry to say that, but I think you are. Percy can't do anything. They're a plant. I mean, they, they can look after the car. Uh-oh. But other than that, I don't think I can walk through the fire, can I? That's not a good idea. Those boys are big. Okay, so we need to destroy that. So, Enid... Ooh. Actually, can I get Brick to stand here with your stick? Yes, I know. Calm down. And then ugh, we could just ram it. No, that's not going to be a good idea. Not good because you can ram things with your car, but it does damage them. I don't want to walk through fire. I don't know if that's going to hurt me or not. I mean, it probably is going to hurt me. Uh, okay. Herc, I need you to stand here. Here. There we go. And Enid, I need you to be here and be ready. Okay. Okay, that's fine. That worked better than uh, th than I could have hoped. So Herc can go in. Enid can't go that far. I don't. Yeah, so you can't walk through the fire. Okay, it's good to know. Um. Very well, so we're going to need Enid over... But if I go there... I could, yeah, attack him. Bop him. Okay, and then Brick, I'm going to need you to... Oh, you can't put... Ah, okay, they're stunned. That's good. Okay, that's fine. They should be fine. Herc, uh, I don't know what you can do, really. Herc is incredibly useful at this juncture. Can they push that or anything? They might be able to push it. They might be able to be a good boy. Go in there and be a good boy. Uh, now... End the turn. Uh-oh, that fuel is spreading. Uh-uh. Okay, the fire's spreading. Can you push that out of the way, boy? Yes, you can. You're a good boy. Um, You can search that or you can push that again. But I don't think we can go through this fire. Push that again. Be a good boy. I don't know if we can go through that. I'm hoping we can. Uh, okay, I'm going to need you to... Brick, I need you to shove him. There we go. Uh-oh. And I'm going to need you to get back. Enid, you need to get in the car. We're going to have to pick up... Um, Herc on the way through, so turn the car on. End the turn. And hope this works out. Uh-oh. Reinforcements, yeah. So, Brick, get in the car. Uh, the car is currently on. We're not going to ram the car the doggo. That would be bad. Wait, does that mean that they'll get in the car? I don't know. I think that means they'll get in the car. Uh, yeah, pull in. Pull in. Perfect. Pull Herc in. There we go. That gets them. Doggo gets in the car. 
and then we have to end the turn here. Everything is fine. Everything is fine. And we escape. Woo! <laughs> and that is like a, a, a mini boss, if you will. A mini boss of an area. Woo! And Percy's just chilling on the back. Yeah. Okay, we're making it. We're getting there. Oh, boy. There we go. Into the woodlands. 296 miles travelled. And, uh, yeah, it's now a nice autumnal look. A nice autumnal look in the woodlands. Hmm. It's pretty. There we go. Not the most comfortable car I ever drove. Can't believe we made it through that mess. Whiff. I'm feeling hopeful. Aww. Whiff. <laughs> okay, where'd... Ooh, used to be a pharmacy. Used to be a barter camp. Or more fuel. We'll, we'll go to the barter camp. We might be able to get something. And then we can always go and get some fuel or... Yeah, we'll, we'll then have to go for the fuel. So, oh, but then I could go for fuel on the first aid kit. But if I need first aid kit, pretty much everyone dies because I tried to save everyone anyway. Uh, so we might as well go and see what the what we can barter. Percy might be able to find a new home. He might be able to uh, hack last a med kit. That'd be pretty good. That'd be pretty good. Let's see. We might even be able to get a friend. Hello. <gasps> Look at the doggos. Hi. Okay. Enid, play it cool. What's up? Yeah, what what are you looking to barter? We could use a plant! <gasps> Percy, you're gonna save us! Okay, so we need a roof rack. Perfect. So yeah. Uh brick, can you you've got a stick at the moment, but can you organize that please? Actually, Herc, you're a friendly doggo. Come bring the plant over. Good boy. There we go. Percy, we've got some new family for you. They're going to look after you. They're going to help you grow. And in return, we're going to have a wonderful roof rack so we can carry many things. Okay? Let's end the turn there. Oh, the roof rack or rucksack? No, we'll go for the roof rack. Uh, Herc, I need you to drop the plant, please. Oh, relax. Oh, you can relax. Okay, I need you to drop that. Oh, thank you. And then you can go over here. And then relax. Oh, <laughs> so cute. Okay, pick that up. Head over here, and then we'll barter that with you. Just give me the plant. Yep. So we'll trade that for hand over the plant. Yep. Here you go. Which one do you want? I would like the roof rack, please. There we go. Trade items with the camp. Now you want a gas can. We don't have that, but uh, we are good. Thank you. Can you pull you in, please? Get in! Good boy. Okay, and the turn. And let's get Enid over here. Put that on there. There we go. Pick up a stick. Pick that up. There we go. Put the stick on the top. There we go. And now we've got three slots rather than just the one. Do you need two fuel? Well, you're not getting two fuel. We are leaving! Uh, I said... Can you pull in the human, please? Thank you! <laughs> Just pull the human and it's fine. Yeah, the problem is if Enid goes down, the rest of the doggos aren't going to be able to drive the car, so we need to really look after our human. Uh, let's end the turn there, and then we'll get a wiggle on. There we go. Turn the car on, and leave. Escape! Take it easy, will do! Thanks for the, the roof rack thing. Look after Percy! I miss Percy already. It'll be risky, but there should be some fuel. Yeah, we do need to go get the fuel. So, yeah. There's, there's a new car, but I kind of upgraded my current car. So, I'm not really feeling that one. Let's go and get some more fuel. Nice. As everybody's got sticks and good things. Oh yeah. <laughs> Brick likes their stick. I'm glad Brick likes their stick. Uh-oh. Night time. Um. Hmm. I don't think dogs can siphon fuel. Uh, I'm going to need you to siphon that. Oh, there's a person over there, apparently. End the turn. Okay, you're just exploring that a little bit. Uh, you've got a couple of boys over there. I'm going to siphon this further. And then fill this up. Uh, got one alien boy down there. I think he's a 
small lad? I think? I can't quite tell. Um, okay, Brick, go over here. And then, in the turn. Oh, but... Uh-oh! What? I d don't know what happened there. Can you just search that for me, Brick? And then I'm going to want you to get in the car. Okay, pick that up. And... Uh-oh. Okay, get over here. Uh, can you grab... Can you grab Brick, please? I don't know if you can... No, you can't grab Brick. Okay, we're going to get in the car. Oh, God, I don't want to run the dude over. Get, get in the car. Okay, turn it on. Back it up. Can you get it? Pull them in. And we're going to have to end the turn here. Oh, that's not a good idea. What, what are you doing? We need to leave, dude. Oh, this is not good. Okay. Um... Oh, there's a shield there! Okay, wait, 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 wait. Brick! Be a good boy and grab the shield! Pick it up! Get back in the car! <laughs> good boy! <laughs> okay. I wanna leave, but I don't wanna ram the thing! Okay, end the turn. Oh, they're leaving, apparently. Uh, I don't wanna ram it! Ah! Uh. Um, okay, if I go there, that's one move. Killing them will be another. Okay, go here. I'll just ram it. I don't like having to do that, because now the car's a little bit hecked, and we're going to have to get a car repair thing. But, uh, it's kind of a, an emergency here. Are you kidding me? It's blocked. Okay, brick. I'm going to need you to be a very good boy. Apparently I can't push that out of the way. Oh, get in, get in, get in, get in, get in. This is not good. Uh, that would blow up the car. I can't, I can't blow up the car. Oh no, 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 no. Okay, that was a waste of a move. Uh oh. Stop filling up the. Mm. What are you trying to do? Yeah, that wasn't a good idea, was it, mate? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. There's a lot of... Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Okay, turn... Enid, turn off the car! Stop it! Okay, get here. I'm gonna need you to whack that dude. Thank you. We've got some more lads coming over here. We're gonna have to end the turn. Okay, that guy's over there. That's fine. Hold it! Okay. Uh, I can't... What am I supposed to do with this body? I can't move it or anything. I can't move that. I can't ram it. How do I go around? Get back in the car. Yeah, I can't go around. Hmm... Yeah, I can't go around that way because the car's here. Brick, can you get out and push that? No. So I'm kind of stuck. Okay then, well... Is this dude going to help me out? I don't think that dude's going to help me out. Uh, we might have to walk this. Not the best plan, but it's the only plan I currently have. Okay, tur turn off the bloody car. Uh, get out the car. Brick, I'm going to need you to... No, no, brick, 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 brick. Thank you. I need you to go over here. We're going to have to abandon the car, unfortunately, because we can't, we can't go any further. Oh. Uh. Okay, we're fine. Oh, no. Okay, brick moved out of the way. Good. Okay. Everybody, we're leaving the car behind. <laughs> Got to escape. Come on, everyone. <laughs> yeah, this isn't going to be good. This isn't going to be good. I kind of screwed myself over by killing the guy where uh, 
where it was. So now we're in a very dangerous situation where we don't have a car, it's night time, and there's all the aliens in the world. We need to grab fuel and we need to get out of here. Um, brick. Uh, Enid, if, if Enid goes there. Okay. Herc, you need to go here. Enid, you need to go here. We're going to end the turn. Oh, it can move twice! I forgot about that. Don't kill the doggos. Okay. I forgot. The these things can move twice. So my human's probably going to die. Um, Okay, Brick, you need to move. Oh, no. Oh, no. Our human's going to die. Uh, Brick, be a good boy. Run. You two have got to be good boys now, okay? Oh, it they got, they got stunned. It got stunned. Run! <laughs> Run, Enid! I believe in you! Okay, uh... Brick, can you grab fuel? Can you grab fuel anywhere? I need you to grab some fuel. Perfect, okay. Uh, Fuel is more important right now. Pick that up. Uh, Now, Brick, I need you to give that to your human. So drop that for me. Perfect. And Herc, I need you to go over here to get in the car, okay? Uh-oh. Yeah, I, I know they're hunting us. Okay, Enid, you need to do them a deadly... Ooh, hold on. Uh, if you push them back, that's one, two, but then there's not going to be able to do anything. Okay, twat it. There we go. Now, boys, I'm going to need you to not get in the car. You need to go... Oh! You found something! Good! Okay. Brick, you need to go here. Oh, that, that's the car you can get in, but I don't want to get in the car because then that thing will hit me! Oh, no. Um... So, yeah, they then were rescued by the National Guard and everybody lived happily ever after. I don't want to play! <laughs> I don't want to play and have Brick and Herc die while, while their human is injured. This is Overland, and as you can see, it is brutally difficult. Brutally, brutally difficult. And if you own the the bundle, then this is a game that should be on your radar because it's amazing and very sorrowful. And I don't want Brick and Herc and Enid to die, so I decided I'm not going to play it anymore. <laughs> I don't want them to die, okay? I'd feel bad. It's kind of my fault. It is kind of my fault, indeed. If this is your sort of thing, definitely check it out. But if you're not into the hardcore type of gameplay, then you might want to give this one a miss because you don't want doggos to go deadly booped. Unfortunately, it does indeed come to that shield, shield, shield bit this video. If you did enjoy it, you know, hit that follow button. And if you massively enjoyed it, hit the subscribe button. If not, it's perfectly fine as well. Those sorts of things can go and be rescued by the National Guard and totally not die. Not at all. Nope, nope. Our puppers and their vet were completely fine after these events. Completely fine indeed. But yes, thank you so much for watching our videos, live streams and VODs. I hope you have a wonderful evening and indeed a good night.